And this is Kofa. Hello. Hello, guys. Hello. <laughs> we are making pancakes. Yeah? You gonna help me? Uh, wait, I wanna say, I'm gonna help too. <laughs> <laughs> this is Saturday morning for us. <laughs> Okay, so we finished eating breakfast, kind of a late morning. It's about 10.30 right now. We've just kind of been relaxing. The kids are watching spooky stories on Netflix because it's that time. We love watching a lot of Halloween stuff during October. And then we hit the Christmas hard, like November 1st. <laughs> we love watching like seasonal movies. So they're watching that while I clean the kitchen really quick. And then, I am going to tidy up a little bit because we have somebody coming over to take a look at our table up front and she should be here in about 35 minutes. So I'm crossing my fingers that this time it goes through and we can go ahead and sell the table and that way we can just move on and continue with um, like organizing and decorating that front area because I haven't really been able to do that. So after that, we're gonna be outside working. Um, Nelson has some stuff that he's gotta do in the yard. He's got some debris that he's gotta, you know, move around and take care of before we haul it to the um, junkyard because we do have some construction stuff that we did recently in the basement where we removed some items because we're gonna have a lot of work done very soon on the house. Um, and that'll be a video for another day. But there's just stuff that he's gotta move around in the yard that's just kind of been laying there. And then he's gotta burn some stuff because we have a burn barrel outside. So we're gonna go ahead and just get rid of some scraps of like cardboard and wood and just stuff that we just, we just need to burn and get rid of. And then hopefully we're gonna try and install a swing for the kids. We have a really big tree in the front yard and I bought a swing a couple weeks ago in the hopes of installing it, but we just have not been able to. So we're gonna try and install it today. It's gonna be a really beautiful day. High of only 71, which is so nice. It's like 55 degrees right now. Um, so it's gonna be a beautiful day for us to be outside and get a few things done in the in the nice weather doing a control burn on these stumps so I can burn most of it off and then I'm gonna rent like a uh, I forget what they call but the, the, it's a big thing that has a big stump grinder stump grinder there you go <laughs> so that's just to soften it up since they're kind of big so obviously I got my shovel digging around it I know unfortunately this area has kind of stayed like this since we took the trees down because we have these stumps and until we can get rid of these stumps we can't come in here and just like, you know, flatten everything out and just mulch everything. So now that they're a little dry because they've been like this for a while and the temperatures are cooler and we can be out here monitoring them a little bit easier for us, we're trying to just have them burn down, right babe? Okay, let me explain. I made this whole little mini road all by myself. This is the road. Now the only way is to a parking lot, which I made myself, and then there's a little slide up right here. Exit. Whoop! And Almost had an accident right there.
Yeah, babe, where did all these bricks come from? Well, these came all out of the front yard, in between all the trees that we cut out. So I don't know if these were borders at one point in time, but I dug them up because uh, I planned to till it and then just have some grass and, you know, uh, grind all those stumps so we can actually just have an enjoyable front yard. But look how many bricks. Look at all that. That is all the random like pieces of masonry that we have found throughout the front yard. And once you think you're done, there's more, right, babe? I mean, it's crazy. It just they just keep coming out. But I mean, I guess we have brick for a really cool project. <laughs> yeah, I know. Well, I'll make something out of these. That way. You don't, I don't want them to go to waste because they're nice. They're good. Yeah, brick. I mean, other than the dirt, I'll clean that up. But I mean, these are. Really good condition. Yeah, so <laughs> eventually we'll be making something out of this. <laughs> I know we got a lot of projects to do inside the house, but honestly, sometimes it's just feels good to come outside and just sweat, you know? <laughs> Smell like the outdoors. You can't be cooped up inside all the time. So. I know. We have projects to do inside, but yeah, it's a beautiful day. Great news, the sale went through, it happened. Um, I had a lady late last night contact me and she wanted to come today. She was an older woman and her husband who had just inherited some mahogany chairs from a death in the family. And apparently she was looking for a mahogany table because the chairs were mahogany. And so she saw this and you know, she fell in love with it online. And it's, it's funny because we, we're so hesitant to say, okay, come on over, come check it out. Because we were so jaded by the previous buyers because they put us through the ringer and then they, you know, they just said no at the last minute. <sighs> but I'm so happy that it went to someone that will really appreciate it. Somebody who knows the value of that table because it was a very expensive table. And somebody who's gonna use it for something a little bit more meaningful, like, it was chairs that she inherited and now she's gonna pair it up with a beautiful table and she was really happy. She was really sweet. And so I'm glad we went ahead and said, okay, come on over, take a look at it, you know. It's times like these that you have to just reflect and just trust that God has a better plan for you. You know, it didn't work out with the first one, but I think God just wanted me to sell that to somebody else who really wanted it and desired it and had, I guess, something bigger for it in mind. I don't know. It's just, it's it's those moments that kind of, you know, just really let us know that, you know what, there's a plan. There's a reason why things happen and he's in control and it's okay because it will work out. And it did. So I'm very happy. Every time I saw something on Facebook Marketplace, it's so weird. I think I'm like more emotional or more, uh, I put more thought into it than most people because to me, the biggest thing is that it will go to somebody who will really appreciate it as much as we did when we had it and used it. Again, I know that not everybody thinks this way, but that's just how I am, which is probably why I was so frustrated in the first place with the first buyers. Um, but it's okay because it was all made up today. It was, it was, it was perfect. It was so nice to meet somebody so nice and kind who was going to appreciate the table. So anyways, I'm done now. <laughs>
we paired it with some sauteed potatoes as well as some zucchini chips and I was so exhausted by the end of the day that I totally forgot to film myself and do my sign out at the end of each video. So I guess this will be it while well, you can see me cook. Um, but yeah, I was happy that we had a great day and um, it was a very productive one too. And I will see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Hope you guys are enjoying these. Until then, adios.